What's up YouTube, Kainu back here again for another video. Today I'm going to show you how to set up the Ikigol foot pedal to use with OBS to switch your scenes or whatever hotkey you want to use it for. If you find this video informational, drop it down in the comment section and make sure you like and you subscribe. I do have a special tip at the end if you do want to wait around for that. Without further ado, let's get in the video. Okay, so starting off, the first thing you want to do is take your Ikigol foot pedal and plug it in it can be this one it can be the yellow one it can be the three pedal one it doesn't matter just plug it into any usb port on your computer all right next up you're going to head over to the site pcsensor.com and then there's a little bit after the pcsensor.com but i'm going to link it down in the description for you guys and then you're going to click on the most recent chicago us download right here click it download it takes a few seconds to download for me then you're going to open it up and then you're going to click on the foot switch right here and you're going to download it so wait for it to load up it's going to say windows protected your pc all you're going to do is click on more info and then run anyway and click next 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 wait for it to load and it should only take a few seconds but i'll fast forward this part to when it's ready Okay, now it is ready, so we're gonna click close, and then we're gonna come down to our Windows search bar down here, and we're gonna click, not click, and we're gonna type in foot, and then right here, foot switch. We're gonna go ahead and click on foot switch. Oh, we gotta redo that real quick. Foot switch, there we go. So we're gonna click on foot switch. It's gonna open up the program for the foot switch. Give it a second. And then mine is automatically going to find it. And then I've already assigned a key to it. But if you do not find it automatically, what you can do is come down to your Windows button right here. Right click and then go to Device Manager. And then you can go to your actual computer right here. Right click and then scan for hardwood, hardware changes. And it should pick up your little USB foot pedal and you should be good to go. It should find it in the actual software now. Once it's loaded into the software, you can assign it to any key on your keyboard. I typically recommend a key that you don't use literally at all because you don't want your scenes randomly transitioning. I'm using the slash in this instance. So all you do is you type it in right there in the box. And then if you want it to be a press trigger, which means if you press it down, then it's going to activate or if you want it to be a release trigger which means you hold it down and then whenever you release it then that's when it's going to trigger okay i'm going to choose press trigger in this instance and then i'm going to click save to key it's going to take a few seconds and then it's going to say successfully save to key all right so now we are in obs i'm going to show you how to set up your foot pedal as a hot key for your scenes so what we're going to do we're going to head down to settings in the bottom right we're going to go to hot keys and then you're going to go to the specific scene that you want to transition to. So in my instance, I want to transition to starting soon. So we're going to scroll down until we find starting soon. And then we see switch to scene. We're going to click in the switch to scene. And then we're going to click on our foot pedal. And as you can see, the little slash that I set up in the actual foot pedal software is there now. So we're going to click apply. And then we're going to put both of our hands up in the air and see if it works. So we're going to click on the foot pedal now. All right. As you can see, it just switched to another scene, and that's how you set it up to switch to different scenes within OBS. The one quick tip I did want to show you is how to mute your microphone while you're streaming with your foot pedal. So what you're going to do, you're going to head back into settings, back to hotkeys, and then you're going to scroll down. Let me originally erase my switch to scene right here, and I'm going to scroll all the way down to microphone, and as you can see, you have mute and unmute. I'm going to go ahead and click on mute. And then I'm gonna click my foot pedal and I'm gonna click on unmute. I'm gonna click my foot pedal and then boom, right there. I have set up my foot pedal to mute my mic and unmute my mic. So as you can see within OBS, if you look down at the bottom, I'm currently recording in Streamlabs. But if you look at OBS, if I click my foot pedal, it mutes my mic and then I click it again, it unmutes my mic. So that's how you set up the foot pedal for scenes and to mute your microphone. If you have any other questions drop them down in the comment section and then if you like the video make sure you like and you subscribe and then don't forget to take it easy